We turn back to reporter Vinay Simlot, who is live on the roads for us. Vinay, there has been some heavy rain in parts of North Knox County. And we drove around most of East Tennessee today and we saw lots of water pooling on the roads, especially on the right sides of the roads where it's getting near the median. Right now we're in downtown Knoxville where the roads look immaculate and it really depended on where you were and how much rain was falling today with how bad the roads looked. The ground is already soaked from rain and snow. More rain doesn't have anywhere to go. It's, it's not going to be much infiltration. It's going to be a lot of runoff. In Knox County, Public Works Director Jim Snowden is watching the roads where it's raining the heaviest. There, there's prone flooding in the Powell community. Uh, now on Old Emory Road, there's some problem areas. In Blunt County, the Highway Department is watching roads like Caldwell Lane. Water is pooling on the sides of the road, slowing down people who drive. Monroe County is seeing water pooled too. Luckily, most of it is staying under the roads, not on top. And that's why TVA is spilling some of the water off the Tennessee River to keep the levels low. Every bit of additional water they can release down towards Chattanooga benefits Knox County. Snow piled on the sides and rain most of Thursday means another week of careful driving on East Tennessee roads. Uh, hopefully we get through this uh, snow and pr uh, following rain without too much difficulty. And our photographer David Rayborn is giving you a beautiful shot of downtown Knoxville today. A reminder, if you're going to be out driving on these roads, remember to give yourself a little extra space. AAA does not recommend you use cruise control, especially when there's water on the roads. And if you do hydroplane, meaning your wheels are not in contact with the ground, maybe ease off the accelerator. Don't slam on the brakes until you can get to a patch where the road is clear. And that's how it's been. There have been small puddles, but then you'll get back on the road all day today. John Robin. Vinay Simlot live in the heart of downtown Knoxville. Thank you, Vinay. Now when it comes to flooding, just six inches of water can sweep a person off their feet. Never drive through standing water. Don't walk or play in floodwaters and always report flooding. A reminder, if you are driving, you can lose control of your car with just six inches of rain. It can also stall. Your vehicle can float in one foot of water and two feet of water. It can sweep your car away. Plus, you never know the condition of the road under the water. T. Crews are